Hello and welcome back to my let's play on Total War Free Kingdoms with Liu Bei on Legendary Difficulty. Well, last time I left off, we have been doing quite well. However, we have a alarming amount of Dongzhou or well, Kingdom of Zhou armies on our border now. Which are definitely going to be taking some of my lands. To be fair, most of the land around here is not particularly worth a whole lot. It's all the most recent shit I've taken. Um, we're moving up. Northwards with uh, Guan Yu's army, so he's gonna try and stop them. In fact, I might just sail them all the way up the river until here and then get off here. Although I did want to take uh, Ba, but I guess there's not really any reason to do that anymore, to be honest. Uh, we are sending this army up this way. We have uh, Sun Jian's army being recruited here, and we have uh, her, Liu Yu Min, coming up this way too, my well, Liu Bei's ex wife. This army is coming back in almost, well, like, it's going to be quarter strength, but uh, in the next turn. It's probably going to take attrition immediately, though, so that's good. Uh, and we're still hanging out here, and I actually was thinking I, I could attack this army here in the water. I don't think they get any reinforcements, so kill that army off easily. Maybe even attack that one too, but I was checking it, and we only have 12% uh, uh, movement remaining. If I do that, they'll run away, so, well, probably anyway, I imagine so. Um... We also have an army here which was replenishing. I had actually recruited a whole bunch of archer militia in here, but I think I I made a poor choice doing that. What I should do is I should probably recruit at least one more uh, trebuchet and then maybe get like, I don't know, two units of defenders of earth and two units of crossbowmen or something. Just mix it up a little bit and try different units. So I'm probably going to do that. Before we do anything else though, I need to recruit some archers in here. I was looking at uh, the people available. There's quite a few. Previous um, relations don't matter as much anymore because even if this guy is a spy from there, it doesn't matter that much because um, we are. This person is. It, we're not. We're not at war with them anymore. Uh, this guy is from Yuan Shu, but I noticed yeah, he's 67 years old, so can't really rely on him to live very long. Ma Mi Di is also from uh, Yuan Shu, so he should be trustworthy because Yuan Shu is just uh, he's an, he's a, the vassal of my allies. That's not really a problem. And this guy from Liu Dai. Uh, could again be a spy, but then again, Liu Dai has been my mate for a very long time, but I, I think I trust him the least. So, let's see who, Mami D and Ji Miao, if they like either one of those two in here. Mami D is definitely the better level one. He likes Sun, Sun Jan. This guy is not liked by either one, but he also isn't disliked by either one, so fuck it, let's take him. Also level 4, so we can get the uh, G, uh, Yi archers in here. Yi archers. I was tempted to go for two of these, but eh, I don't want to spend all my money on units, so let's not go too mental, but I think that is something I need to start doing as well. Just getting two trebuchets in each army. But yeah, here we'll do something different. Uh, do I want any archers? I guess I can I just get two onyx dragons then, and two defenders of earth. That makes this very fucking expensive though, I just realized. Um, now let's get a couple of regular crossbows. And then, well, actually, no, we'll do this the other way around. Do I want some Defenders of Earth? They are very expensive, but they sound like they could be quite good. You know what? No, let's do this. Let's get, um, here we'll get a Defenders of Earth. And then these two are going to be, uh, crossbows. Regular crossbows, not repeating crossbowmen, because I don't really like the repeating crossbowmen. And then these are just going to be regular archers, instead of militia archers, because even though they're a little bit more expensive, it's not really a big deal. And it makes this army a lot better. So now we have like, uh, these guys are, wait, let me just do this. These guys are 150 range, these guys are 200 range, these guys are 250 range, and these guys are 500 range. So we have like damage coming in from all different ranges, which is pretty cool. Uh, and I'm also no longer needing you here, so I think you're going up this way too. I wouldn't mind a, one more turn of replenishment, I guess, so let's just move normally for one turn and then we'll start sprinting. You are kind of replenishing a single unit. I think I'm gonna hold off on on that and just. Well, first of all, we should just jump across the water here. Go that way as well. Um, we recruited a dude around here somewhere, I believe. There we go. He was gonna go annex this. Thanks. This is now mine. I don't really want to spend too much money on upgrading stuff. I have kind of been thinking about that. Like, I, I do want to. Um, like, again, I like I said, I want to I want to have everything left, like, in a good position. Um, but that doesn't necessarily mean I have to build everything up right now, because that's not as relevant. I think for the moment, we just got to make money 
and make sure we we win this war because that's the most important thing. Uh, Guan Yu, you're definitely hopping in this water no matter what. And then whether we sail all the way up it, oh my god, that's one turn. Or if we could take this, nah, I don't think we're gonna bother taking down the way. We'll just sail all the way up here. What if I do do that? Okay, that's actually still working out. Okay. Uh, anyone else got movement? You. Liu Yumin? Yeah, and Liu Bei as well, actually. So you are not replenishing at all, so that's all good. So I guess, yeah, you're just going in this direction for the moment. And you definitely are too. You need a turn of replenishment. Oh, I'd take one turn then, maybe. Uh, yeah, well, he actually a little bit wounded on the generals are as well, so let's just take one turn of replenishment. We'll make our stand around here somewhere. Like, these two are going to take that, and I don't know if they're going to go south or not, but we'll see. Then Guan Yu can stop them. Guan Yu against these two or should be alright. Um, and if these guys, like, that's Lu Bu and uh, Zhang Liao, to be fair, and uh, this guy is uh, Zhu Rong. So that, that one, we do need um, a fairly solid... Like, we, need, we probably need two armies against that, to be honest. Then again, Liu Bei's army. Pretty solid. Maybe replace a couple more of these units as well, actually. Uh, can I afford all four of them? I don't think I can. Not quite. I'm tempted to do so regardless, though. Well, not all of them then, because I can't afford it, but two of them and then maybe the other two later on. Let them replenish as well. Alright, you're replenishing. I got two in there as well. This one's probably just... Uh, oh, no, this one's got the spear guard, so that one's good too. Right, so let's see if we can get a little bit of money by attacking this force. Hopefully I can reach them all the way. Yeah, definitely. I don't know if I'll be able to get back in. Maybe if I run. Make a night battle for the extra experience. Or uh, extra... Make them even weaker. That was kind of painful. Didn't get a lot of money. Ooh, Mao Ji. Interesting is that he actually already had four traits. Um, which means... Because normally if you beat someone like this in battle, sometimes they get like, uh, for example... Oh, we got him as well. Wow. Uh, they get like uh, maimed or one eye or something like they, something gets destroyed in in the battle because they got beaten. But this guy, because he already has, he can only have four extra traits beyond the free initial one, so he actually just straight up um, couldn't get one even if even if it did happen. Yeah, minus four cunning though, which is kind of shit. But otherwise, he's pretty solid. Um, yeah, I'm gonna replenish this. Or I'm gonna recruit this guy. You, Gongshen Chungqing. That's not confusing at all. Um, I don't really have a need for you. You're level one. Nothing of value. I'll let you go. That's fine. Uh, yeah, I'll take the replenishment. Alright, so that was pretty good. Uh, you can indeed make it back, so we'll go ahead and do that. Sweet. So that gives us another uh, good, solid dude. Interested to see whether... You guys would like that man or not? Shang Cheng, is that him? No, it was Ma Su. Was it? It was. Huh? It was this guy, Mao Jie. Okay, so they don't really like him that much. Actually, no. The only person who doesn't like him is the guy with, who would be re being replaced. Kind of annoying, since I obviously just recruited all these units, but I would still prefer just having. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll just put him in the next army. We'll see. Um, yeah, well, well, it doesn't really matter that much. Alright, we've got a whole bunch of thingy mabobs that I can do. Uh, I guess we'll build that because we need happiness, and that's probably all I can do. We need happiness here too, grain storage. We need, we need that at some point there regardless, so it's fine. This one is minus 11, fucking hell. Faction support though, that's all going to go away over time. This shouldn't really be a problem. Alright, uh, you've done that, now, do I take you all the way over here? Six turns, if I run, it'd probably be four turns. Or do I just start sending you down this way to take all these lands, and then I'll just recruit someone else to do this here. I think that makes more sense. Uh, in the small city there, or in this copper mine? I think this is probably just as fast. Can I afford anyone? This guy's 450. I don't have 450. Alright. Sounds good. 
Okay, uh, diplomacy. Is there anything else I can do? There is trade available, but no one wants that. This, yeah, she, hui doesn't really... Or I'm not going to be able to make that happen. Do I want to be friends with you? Uh, I guess. I don't really have a reason not to be. Obviously, this is the guy I've been friends with since the beginning of the campaign. Uh, it's surprising he still lives, to be honest. He is Kong Rong's vassal right now. Kong Rong, not really my mate anymore, which is why I'm keeping uh, her army still there. And of course also against Gong Shinzan, to be fair. Uh, anyway, I, I don't know. I'm not really too worried about that, to be honest. Military access I can get as well. I'd love some more trade, but that's not gonna happen. Right. Well, I think we're gonna lose a town or two, but that's okay. Let's end the turn. Functions. All oh, right, I, I was actually going to try and attack that one as well, but I totally forgot. So, too late now. I think they would have run away though, so it wouldn't have mattered much. Lubu coming this way. That guy's going that way. Oh, and there's another army. Oh, right. I think I knew about that one, but I totally forgot. And that one is the one that just replenished fully, basically, out of nowhere. Hopefully, it's still taking uh, attrition. Though. That'd be nice. That'd be nice. Uh, okay, fuck it. I'm not gonna bother asking more money or something, just... I'll take it. I will take it. Oh my goodness! Sun Ling. Oh, I guess that's one of uh, Sun's, Sun, Jin, Sun Jian's uh, boyos. Um, soldiers whilst on patrol can hear tapping from beneath them. This is a sure sign of the enemies beneath us. Attempting to sap our defenses. We must deal with this immediately. Oh, we're being... Um, Okay. Um, sure. Destroy the equipment. Why not? Okay, we're not going to be able to do much here, to be honest. There's no army here or anything. Unless we had a... No. Unless we have a... Um, uh, and a commander in that place. What do you, what do you call it? Right, so are you still taking attrition? Yeah, you are. Okay, so we don't have to really worry about that for still. Um... I'm going to have to worry about him, though. He's going up that way. We do have this army here. And that one, too. So, yeah, we'll just keep... Oh, yeah, you keep running that way. That's fine. You're going to start sprinting up this way now towards Chen. Although, I was... No, yeah, I was going to think... I was thinking about replacing this guy, but I'm not going to. Uh, you need a little bit more replenishment. One turn will definitely do you very well. I think you're going to try and make our stand... I'll replace these two other units too, actually. Then this army is pretty damn good. Takes me three turns to get there. That's fair enough. If I were sprint, it would probably still be... Actually, I don't know. If I sprint, I'll be able to get there next turn. But I think I'd rather take the replenishment. Except this is not my turn. Oh, no, yeah, it is. I was going to say. It didn't look like I was replenishing there. Alright, uh, you can go to the Jade Mine here. Okay. Kind of getting split up, but that's okay. I really would like to have her army not be here anymore, to be honest, but... What would it take to get peace with you? Mm, not gonna give you any land. Maybe... F actually... Things are... Well... Even if I get peace with him, I'm still not going to pull my armies out of there, because I think she's more there to keep Kong Rong in check than than that, to be honest. So I'm just going to leave him there. Leave her there, even. Uh, loyal, intrepid, and trustworthy. Sounds good. Sun Ling. Right. I don't think we're going to keep you, I'm afraid. Even though you're one of uh, Sun Jian's sons, I have no current need for you. So, see ya. Fuck off. Monkey on the car. Alright, who are you? I see you. Alright. That was terrible. Uh, Mao Ji. That's the new guy. He's available. Crap, that that's probably not worth upgrading right now. If that was going to do anything, it'd have to be some kind of money. I Don't tell me I lost this much money from losing this, by the way. One thing I should do, actually... Actually... Is I should um, I should do that thing where people just trade um, food for for provinces. 
Let's just jump through the river, shall we? That's much faster. And then I was gonna recruit someone here. That could be that ICU person, I think. Yep. Don't need them. Not gonna be paying upkeep for them right now. And then you're just literally going there. That doesn't help right now, does it? You see, can you? No, you can't do that in that stance anyway, so. 4,000 bucks to colonize that place. Alright. Um, faction support. Faction support, yeah. That's all gonna go away, so honestly, all these towns that are unhappy currently are gonna be happy at some point. Okay. Um, we have one more army that apparently has yet to move. Go and use our army, right? Got your movement set up, so you should be alright regardless, but... I'm leaving this completely empty now. If they want to just declare war on me, they, they can just do so. There's not much I can do about it, I'm afraid. Um, yeah, there's no point trying to sally out here, I think. I'm just going to hold them up as long as possible by just being there. If they want to fight, they can fight. You're replenishing for a little bit longer. Uh, I'm not going to recruit another army because I am getting a little bit broke. I have... Let's see, who else hasn't moved yet? So yes, yeah, you and you, right? We already that. And then this army, yep. Alright, fair enough. I got some purple going on here. Rebellion? So, oh, son of a besiege, right. I was gonna say, what the fuck? What incarnation is going on here? Uh, do I spend the rest of my money? That's the real question. I don't know. Probably should. You know what, what I'm, what I'm going to do first, actually, is I'm going to do that, what I said. I'm going to see if I can buy some land from people. Also, you. You unify me yet? Nope, nowhere near. I could ask him for land, but you know what, Kong Rong. Well, he doesn't really uh, appreciate the food, does he? No. What if I were to... Take your land. Didn't I already try this at some? I think I feel, I feel like I tried this quite recently. In fact, yeah, like anything in Longye. Give me that. Twenty-eight. I'd have to give him my land in return. It doesn't really help, does it? That's not the point. <laughs> um, does anyone actually appreciate the food? You. I'll take some of your land. Oh. What will I take? Farmland. Oh no, I don't. I don't want all of them. Just uh, give me. Um, I don't know. I don't really care enough either, to be honest. No, I don't want to give him land in return. I just want to give him food. The thing is, though, my food isn't worth anything. Even though I have, like, it's ten point eight. Actually, wasn't that building like ten, or was that mine? I mean, that was mine actually. Like, I'll gladly give him fifty food, but. Oh I, wait, you can actually inc oh you can actually increase it. Never mind. Give me some land then, you fuck. That doesn't. The thing is, if I take land here, it's gonna get taken immediately by those guys. Now that doesn't help me at all. I don't want land from you. I don't want your land. Your land I can take for free. Well, I'll take you. I'll, I'll take some of your land. What about that? I'm already trading food with you. Never mind. I can't take your land. You, I'm not trading food with. Give me your land. Actually, I'll take trade with you, but you won't give me trade, will you? Oh, never mind. I can probably make that work. Uh, just give him a lot. I'd have to give him almost all my food just for that. Probably just give him money instead, or a couple incideries. Those are worth more. Uh, here's an axe. That's four point five or something, I believe. Um, here's a water clock. I don't like the water clock at all. I just realized earlier. So, there. Boom. Trade. Thanks. So yeah, I went into trade to try and get land from people, but ended up leaving with uh, <laughs> trade instead, which is going gonna, is gonna to increase my income by a lot, so that's good. You haven't got anything to give me except for that, which I can't get because I'm not bordering you. I could probably take something from you. I already bought that one from him, didn't I? So I don't really want anything, to be honest. Fuck it. I'm keeping my food. Um... I moved everything else. I, uh, the only, there's only, there are some buildings that I would build, but there's not a whole lot to be honest. Like here, to build the land developments. 
Anything that I can see that I can build quickly is fine, I guess. I think here we have nothing. This is a uh, rice plate and i food. So build me that one. This is income from peasantry, actually, which means I could go for food, but could also just fucking build nothing instead. Nothing I can build there, even if I wanted to. Do we need happiness here? Not really, but sure, go on. Oh, go on then. All right, cool. Um, let's end the turn. We've got some battles coming soon. Oh. Well. Certainly wasn't expecting that. <laughs> <laughs> we have an army nearby, a couple armies nearby. But I uh, I definitely wasn't expecting that. Where's he going? Where the fuck do you think you're going? Oh yeah, you you were at War of the Han Empire or something. Or something indeed. Uh, you signed peace, whatever, noble birth, Le oh my god! We oh, it's a daughter. <laughs> well, at least we got a kid. I can't believe it, he's done it. <laughs> oh my god. It's taken the better part of the campaign, but he's fucking made a kid. Liu Rupi. Alright, Rupi, 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 it's probably, I don't know, no fucking clue how you pronounce that. Fair enough. Lucky it doesn't matter if it's a boy or a girl in this game, of course. Alright, so what the fuck was going on? Uh, over here. Because we got uh, this army in the water. Uh, he would reinforce, so that's not going to happen. Alright, he'd have to siege me out if he's going for that, but it looks like he's going past. To be honest. Um... His army is fucked. So I think I'd be willing to force march up there with this army. Why don't I recruit a couple good units in here too? And then I'll just sprint. Just get up here. Hello. Can I help you? Right, you're hanging out there. That's not really going to change. Are you at war of him or no? I don't think so. Uh, sorry, I'm looking at the wrong thing. No, you're not. Yo, would you be up for joining my war, though? Hmm. That's not bad. We have lots of food. I'm not really worried about that. Yeah, I'll give you 60 food for that. That's fair for me. Um, yeah, go on then. Join my war against uh, him. He's, we've got a whole bunch of armies right next to we got one army here. Not Then there's a couple down here. I should have done this sooner, really, if I was going to do this, but... Oh, well. <clears throat> Kingdom of Zhu liberated Zhang Yan. Oh, shit. Okay. The fuck? They're still... Okay, they, he's also at war with him, though. So, that's a thing that's happening. Oh well. At least we're spicing things up a little bit. Uh, ooh, he's not, they're not uh, taking attrition anymore. Interesting. Okay. I can actually run in there. I would be attacked. Well, if he wants to, I would be attacked uh, there. But I think with the garrison, he wouldn't actually do that anyway. No, there's no way he's going to attack me there in Force March stands. If, if he does... Actually, he could siege me out for a turn, but... I'd be alright with that. Okay, so Lu Bu is over here somewhere. This is still being besieged. They might sally out or come at me soon, but honestly, fucking Guan Yu's almost here. Um, I will land here. But I don't think I'm gonna run through here. Yeah, even if the game is just saying like, no, you gotta run the other way, mate. Also, I want to check, just out of curiosity, how much would the, this be right now? 37.5, okay. So I want to see the differences after I start killing a couple armies. Okay, so where the fuck did Lu Bu go? He was in there somewhere, wasn't he? we got to start moving up together, I think. Wait, is he right behind that? No, that's not him. I hope you can reach there, and you should can. Perfect. Alright, you're still replenishing a little bit, but this is my territory, so that's fine. 
All right. He, I, no, he couldn't actually go back even if he wanted to. All right, we got the army over here. But I was kind of sprinting up this way, which doesn't really need to be done anymore. In fact, I wonder if I should have run that that way. Now. I probably have enough armies around here. Around here. Uh, yeah, so you got to move still. You, in a 1v1 against Lugu, I'd be fine with. So I'm not going to bother running you over there. These armies are both pretty good as well, actually, individually. You could do with a couple more of those as well. Why not? By a couple more, I mean literally every unit. Actually, hold on. If I cancel that one, you still have four, which is a nice even number, and I'll be able to... Oh, no, I can't reach it right now anyway. Well, fuck. We're doing this after all. Alright. Um, I will build this building. There. Done it. You boys. You boy, even. You're jumping in the water. Hop on in there. It's nice and warm. Uh, and then I guess we'll start... Well, actually, no. We'll start it over here. We do this right now. Oh, come on. Don't be a little bitch. Alright, fine. Whatever. And then we'll take that one, that one. And then there's only two more towns of the Han Empire here and here, but... That'll probably either never happen, or I'll just recruit someone here and do the same thing. In fact, why don't I just do that right now? Uh, do I have the money? To get literally anyone. Masu, who are you? 24-year-olds, Liu Dai. Yeah, I trust you. Don't need these shits, though, do I? Alright. You're off to go take those towns in the next couple turns. The Han Empire will fully be do be gone when we're done with them. Uh, we can build. That's just the Shu on text collection. Now get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. You think you're fucking being cool or something, huh? Ugh, we have a decent garrison there. I might just fight that one. All right, shit might happen this turn. Shit, might happen this turn. Gong Shenzhen still running away. Several armies landed in Dong now. Hopefully they uh, just attack me there. Uh, okay, you being at war didn't make any kind of difference. They actually went for this fight now. It is actually a walled settlement. So I think I'm gonna fight this one. Oof, these guys are super low. I might actually be able to assassinate some people. I have no idea if that's gonna work, but... I'll, um, I'll try. I don't think this is gonna go well in any way, shape, or form. But it's worth, I don't know, doing something, I suppose. It, it is a walled settlement. I think we're uh, we're getting to that point in the campaign where we need to make sure that we win it soon, because we killed these two armies, Liu Bei's arm or Liu Bu's army, sorry, not Liu Bei's army, and the, the other two armies around there. We kill those ones, and I think we just making abdicates, and that means we win the campaign. So let's let's make sure we weaken them a little bit, because Guan Yu's coming up this way. He's going to be here in a couple turns. Let's make sure he's um, doesn't have to do all the hard work. This thing is apparently on 100% fire damage, but it's not actually destroyed yet. That one is, though. Oh, fuck me. Everything's destroyed. <laughs> there's a wall. There's a gap in the wall here. That doesn't help. Um, do I try and defend the wall, or do I just go all the way back and let the towers do some of the work? No, that's not... That's not right. Um, are they going to try... Yeah, they're going to try and push through here. I really want to kill them off, but I have no one that can actually do that specifically. I'll just put you back here. Um, you know what? I've got a cav unit. I could possibly do some stuff. Put you over here. Put some barricades down, I guess. I don't know. Um, no, that's fucking shit. I don't, I, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't really matter, boys. I know you think this is very important, but it doesn't really matter. Let's put one over there. Does it even change anything? I guess it just changes it after the battle actually starts. And one there, because why not? All right, let's just put our shit on the wall. Fire back as much as possible. They have crossbowmen though, so they basically have the archer battle one already. Let's start over here, that's easier. Wait, can I? 
Oh, yes, it's still possible. They still put him on the other side, though, it kind of sucks, but fuck it. But fuck it. Um, I don't really want to shoot that unit because I actually want them to make it through. Then again, no, it doesn't. I, no, I don't mind. Ah, eh, whatever. And I'll put uh, the shield boys right here, right there. And then I've I've done everything, haven't I? All right, I'll probably triple sweep this literally this whole thing. Yes. Yeah, no, they definitely are. Is this busted? No. Straight busted. Might be able to kill the generals off. Actually, is that even useful? I did, did just get new generals in there. It always sounds nice if you do shit like that, but it really isn't that good. Oh man, the game's actually slightly laggy because I'm rendering right now. Sorry about that. Oh my god. Oh, I thought he died for a second there. I'm gonna kill this fucking shit. At least try to. Let's use the melee evasion use. Oh, we kill him. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it, but I honestly don't. Oh fuck, this guy went mad with rage and he's actually just replenished everything. Did we destroy the actual siege thing? I think we have. Yeah, I'll try and kill him. He'll probably kill me, to be honest. Or this cab unit, at least. Why don't we just uh, run back to the tower? Because if, if he's going to chase me, he's going to get shot by the towers. He will die super fast if this thing's still firing. Look, if he gets hit, every arrow will fucking hurt like a truck. Or hit like a truck. Kill the Saber Militia while we're at it. Make sure they don't get hit. It's not really hit, getting hit though, is he? Ah, oh, melee evasion again. Alright, fuck it. Let's leave it there. Kill a unit. Yeah, killing him and the other general wasn't really that useful because they're just gonna get new ones instead. Can you just do this already? I wanna. I don't really wanna sit here for ages doing this battle. I think it's getting fucking wrecked by the uh, crossbows. Not much I can do about it. I can move him back, but then that one gets wrecked, so it's whatever. It probably still helps killing them off. I don't know. We'll see. Can we six double speed it, please? What are you do what are you waiting for exactly? I don't know. Well, I'm gonna sit my Oh here we go, sit my drink while this is happening. It's just a tower from over here not firing. Alright, we're firing back, I think. Oh, oh fuck me, no we're not. I hate this. Change this, CA, please. And do it quickly. <laughs> oh my god, it's such a shit mechanic. Who decided that taking the units off fire at will when you're in a defensive siege was a good idea? I can't believe that. Round two, boys. <laughs> Shit, and since I didn't break through here, I brought this unit over here for nothing. Go over here. I might be able to still use all my ammo, to be honest, but no, we're definitely not doing that. No, we're definitely gonna die before it happens. Well, I definitely missed a volley or two. What a waste. Shoot the archers. It's the only unit we can really damage anyway. Go here. First of all. Did you go in for round two? Uh, yes, but you got wrecked by cavalry and that and and the like. Okay, if only we had a formation there, but we don't. So what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Do I just make a second stand here? Probably not. I'll try and get over here, but it's not gonna happen. Okay, fire at the uh, crossbows. Yeah, normally it wouldn't be lagging, but it's just because I have um. I'm rendering in the background the next episode of the Libre campaign. This campaign, in fact. It's so slow. It's just like... It's it's like... My camera is still smooth, obviously, so it's not the FPS, it's just the fact that it's like... jaggedy, like... <laughs> like that. 
I don't know what the noise was, the sound effect there, but... God, I wonder if this is worth doing or not. I doubt I'm killing anything here, is the thing. Whatever I do kill, they're just gonna replenish again, aren't they? All right, the caveat is fully dead now. Get shot, boys. I wish I had killed him. I'm pretty sure he has more HP now than he had at the start of the, the battle. I should have killed him first and then the strategist. Because if the strategy gets more health back, that doesn't really matter. I'll just kill him anyway. Alright, one of these units is going to route soon. I don't even know if you guys are going to get there in time, to be honest. Sorry. Burp. Did we try and shoot that? We did, like, nothing to that unit. What are you good for? Absolutely nothing. Ooh. This unit routed, okay. Nice! This unit's getting fucking wrecked by range units now. Great. Just get in here. Everyone, get in here! Gotta throw in the occasional Hearthstone reference for no reason whatsoever. Gotta try and kill the general. I don't think killing generals is useful right now. Let's just take down the units as much as possible. All the people always want zoomed in battles. Here you go, boys. Is this what you want? Is this fun to you guys? Huh? Wow, how cool. A thousand flags. And units stabbing at each other, which literally has no effect whatsoever. I don't understand why people want that zoomed in shit. Just go watch Jackie Fish or something and watch the one bazillion troops against six bazillion other troops. Ooh, exciting. Sorry. I just... I never get those videos. Especially back when the FPS was just fucking... When basically the video... Yeah, the, the, the fights were like this. <laughs> Except normal speed. <laughs> now, the only reason this is like this is because it's on triple speed and I'm rendering right now. If I wasn't rendering, it'd be fine. Plus, if, it was, if I was normal speeding, it'd be fine as well. Or more fine, at least. It's still a little bit jaggy, but... Yeah, if I wasn't rendering it, it wouldn't be a problem. Alright, can we just lose now? I think it's time for us to lose this one. We didn't do shit, really. I don't think I could... Oh, there we go. We lost. Fantastic. Did we even kill anything? Uh, I guess we'll see in a moment exactly how much we killed. We took... Hey, this unit's dead. That's the one that was carrying the... 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 Um... The ram. It's called a ram. Battering ram, if you want to be exact or tactical. Yep, you guys won. Nice one, mate. We lost, yeah, we killed. F okay, that was not worth doing. That was not worth spending 15 minutes on or however long it took. Uh, this one. <laughs> I don't want to. <laughs> Probably more worth it, though. Is this the town I was. No, I, was, I wasn't going to reach this town next door. No, th this is the town further, like, that way behind me. Um. We've had a battle before where I did so well that at this point I'm just I feel like I have to do these ones. It it can be really good. Unfortunately, the lagginess is kind of making this experience less fun. We have no cavalry here. The reason that went went so well that time was because I had cavalry. Cavalry makes such a huge difference. All right, what do we got? We got a couple archers here. Cut, cut large just there. And a couple there. Okay, so we got we just got a split of three. Well, alright then. I have no shielded units whatsoever. So that's another fantastic thing that's definitely worth doing this. Hello? Why can't you go further that way, you fuck? I hate you. Um, I don't know. No, I don't think it's worth putting you there. All right, we have one more spear warrior. You're there already. Okay, so let's take the spear warrior from the other side. Put him here because they have more armor than the G militia. Oh, what the fuck? It's supposed to be one unit. How did I manage that? No, I can't place this one anymore. There we go. And you go here. Sure, whatever. That's fine. Um, we got 
free G militia. Oh, we still got you as well, actually. Oh yeah, we also have more places to defend. So you there, you're here. Right, yeah, that's fine. We got G militia. I'm gonna take all the G militia and make like a second line with them. Actually, I need a unit here, I guess. In fact, it's more likely you're gonna go that way anyway, isn't it? So keep an archer here. I should probably keep all my archers on the side where they haven't got any archers and where they have like G militia or something if they have any of those. There's one here. Saber militia. Like all the ar like the armored units, we don't want to be firing at them basically, but fuck it, let's just make a stand against the enemy archers here. Alright. And then yeah, I'm like a unit here. A unit there. And the units here. Alright. Oh, right, 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 right. Fuck you, game. Fuck you. You're not tricking me this time. Wait, all my archer here. I could have just done that. <laughs> Oopsie. Alright. Still gonna lose that archer battle, I think. Even though it's 4v3, but we're in a staggered formation, so they get. That's basically a 1v3, then it's a 2v3, and it's a 1v3 again, so. I mean, we might still win it, but it's gonna be painful. Also, there's infantry coming at me now. Maybe I'll kill one or two units here. Maybe routed the unit before they routed one of mine, so that's good. Let's just send you. No, I'm not gonna bother. Yeah, I will. I could go there. Oh right, I didn't actually put any infantry here at all. Come here. Come here. Alright, they're gonna break from here, but it's whatever. I don't I don't care, right? I'm just trying to do a little bit of damage or something. I should have put you further back, I didn't realize that. Oopsie. Alright, all the extra units are now engaged. Congratulations, by the way. Keep the towers, hold! Hold them! No, it's still mine, they're still mine. They're not mine anymore at all. Wait, I'm the kingdom of Shuhan. It was still mine, oh, never mind. <laughs> Wait a second. That's me! Kill Tufa. Tufa? Tofu. Oh shit, where did this guy come from? Kill him. I have a unit over here doing fucking nothing. Kill him. Oh my god, I might actually rode that guy. What the fuck? Kill him. Kill him, boys. Kill him all. Kill this tofu man. Kill this boy right here. Kill, 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 kill. That guy's actually... Oh, you know, he did ride for a second. It would have been great if he had, because we've seen that before. That's what wins you these fucking battles. This unit routes. Runs outside of the gate. Gets fucking slaughtered by the towers. That's how you win these battles. Alright, you came back. Congratulations. Get back in there, boys. What is everyone else doing? Kill this man. We actually have a chance of killing someone here. He's almost running again. Just not quite. Not too quite too. That guy's almost running too, but we have these towers, so unless he runs that way. It's not gonna matter, is it? I think we might master out in a second here. Come on, kill two fucks in. Oh man, he's actually really low. Oh, yeah. I don't know how useful that really is, but... Might need to come back at these guys. Oh, we're getting shot in the back! They're almost out of ammo, though, but... Kill these fucking archers right here! Yes! I, too, think that is the case. Kill this archer. Yeah, come in. Come and attack me, boys. Yeah. No, don't route. Well, I mean, they, they can, not me, though. No, I said don't route. Why would you do that? I just told you not to do it, and then you do it. I mean, do you even listen to me? What the fuck, man? Oh, wow, we actually killed a whole bunch of units. What the fuck? We did way more than I thought we did. We killed, like, three archery or cavalry units, I mean. Liu Bei might actually be able to get here in time as well. I don't know why I stopped sprinting him. All right, so that's the first two battles against the, the Kingdom of Zhu lost. 
Uh, no, I didn't kill any of those, but they are almost dead. Killed fucking half their force, more than. There's Lu Bu. Looks like we're gonna be able to 2v1 him, though. We got Soon Jan there, and my ex-wife. <laughs> She's scarier than Soon Jan. Alright. And then we got the whole fucking problem in the east. With, um... Gongshin Zan running around my land, and I think Dong might be being the siege right now. Oh no! No, it's that guy! Oh shit, son. Kong Rong, I don't trust this person. But I'm forced to recruit him, her, because I have no choice. Um, he, and this person is 64, so. <laughs> they'll probably die soon anyway. <laughs> Which army is this? Uh, this oh fuck is that the army that's currently in that's is that the army over there in my cap in the former capital? Holy shit! What happened to my income? All right, well, let's see what happens here. It's even lower now. Shang Yan is in the coalition. Gongshin Zan, we lost that place. Yep, we lost the settlement here. Yep. There you go. Yeah, John Rui died from natural causes. Oh right, I know my income so shit. Yeah, because you lost left that. Right, Sha Tai Young. Were you were you a traitor? Uh well no, no, you came over from uh so you're fine then. You can do this shit. Alright, income from commerce and industry. Ah, uh, okay, that's uh three eighty total. Commerce and industry, please. That's a lot. Okay, so far it's Guangling. It's also an extra 15% of like everything. Ooh, no, it's definitely uh, Zhang Ye. I don't think there's any... Pretty sure he was the governor of Zhang Ye. Oh my god, we got a thousand here though. What's Zhang Ye like? Uh, that's 910. Okay, this one might actually be even better. Corruptions, well, it's the same. Oh, well, that one's 10% higher actually, the first one. Uh, how the fuck do we even get that much? All right, so it's it's probably I'll still put him in Janye, I think. We have a higher actual income here in total, I think, which means that that fifteen percent's got a bigger impact too. It's actually almost exactly the same. Uh, I'll still I'll just choose this one. Boom. All right. Oh, also that's oh that's over here. Never mind. Yeah, man. Guan Yu ranked eight. Still not. Anywhere near the God of War ability, though. So 8, 9, 10, 8. He would get it on level 10, which is just shit. Uh, I'll take Guerrilla Deployment, I guess. It's between these two, I guess, unless I want to go... Nah, I think this, this route's better. Alright. Okay. Show me the good shit, boys. John Rui is maimed. Except he's dead, so it doesn't really matter. How did he died of natural causes though? <laughs> just old age. What the fuck? Why did he get maimed before? He just fell off the stairs because he was old. Hey, to general. All right, which army are you in? Oh, hold on. Yes, it's that one because I killed that. It was worth killing the strategist. <laughs> yes, it was. All right, we can uh, we can make him leave, which is good. We can make him revolt essentially. You revolting son of a bitch. Alright, I can get there next turn, no problem. I should have... Actually, no, my supplies are okay. Uh, you need to get away from here. Because those armies might be coming for you soon. Take this place. This is now mine place. Thanks, mate. Alright, Guan Yu. You're going up this way. Fast as fuck, boy. Alright. Uh, so yeah, it looks like we just have him, and he's a force march stance. Doesn't seem like the smartest choice. We also have another 1v1 here. Uh, you are chasing Gongshin Zan. Can you reach him this turn? Oh, I might actually be able to do that. Yes, I can, I think. Can we reach him when he runs away, though? That's a definite no. Okay, well, if that keeps happening, I'll do that thing where I trick him, basically. We are indeed under siege here. It's actually, um, oh, I can night battle it. 
<laughs> oh, fuck me, I took a lot more loss than I thought I would. Alright. Um, I don't want my money's a bit shit right now, I'll take that. Alright, I don't even know if he would actually besiege me without the other army. Oh, if he just done he had a trebuchet in there too. Got your level up, nice one, mate. Uh, I need the calf to go faster. Then again, shock damage roll. Yeah, that's oh, we already had that one anyway. Okay, it was between these two, whatever. I think that one I chose is fine. Wu Fang Lang Fang Lang Gang Zhang Jit. All right, see you later, all of you. Um, haven't looked at any of these things for fucking eight. Well, actually, no, I did that like last episode or something. Okay, so that was good. We dealt with that immediately. Ooh. Who the fuck is this? Gongshin Chu, the very legendary person. Not a piece out yet. Not really, but it's not that difficult. I could probably achieve it somehow if I wanted it, which I don't. I want to kill Gongshin Zana first. With Sun Wen. She gets to do something. Alright. If I make sure I attack this one, I can run you up. For a moment, let's not take that risk. Um, so we got a battle there. We got a battle. We got two battles there, I think. Unless people run away. We've probably got one here. We've got one here coming soon. How is this now? It's probably worse now, right? I'd imagine. But point three, I think. So that hasn't changed much that they took two of my towns. Okay. Uh, we got some shit down here. She'll still do. I guess we'll spend the four grand now taking the town back. It probably isn't worth doing this, to be honest, but. Might as well just uh, finish off this commandery as well, just to make things look better, even. Even better. Uh, I. I don't think I'm gonna bother doing that. I'm also you're gonna take you back. You, however, gonna take this place too. Trade port. Annex this shit. Forced migration. Decreased recruitment for his army. Wait, whose army is this? Zhang Chao. What the fuck? No, I don't want re decreased recruitment here. Uh, I'm gonna pass on this if you don't mind. Re fucking reduce his recruitment just because someone else is over here. We're migrating all the way over here, apparently. Fuck me. Alright, that's not happening, friend. Okay. Have I got any uh, diplomacy that I can do, though? Bunch of maybes, bunch of maybes, a yes there. But one I don't care about myself. No. Alright. Alright, sorry about that. Got interrupted. Um. I think we were basically towards the end of this turn, besides... Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright. Interrupted again. I'm gonna kill some people soon. Right. As I was saying, I think we were towards the end of this turn. Uh, I think the only things I have left to do are the battles, which... Uh, I don't really have a lot of time for right now, so I think we're not gonna do any of those. Kind of wondering if I should replace a couple units here as well. We don't really have a lot of money anymore, but... While I'm da damaged anyway, I might as well just replace two of those guys just to make this army a little bit stronger. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger, right? Um. So yeah, it's just apparently three armies of movements. That one. Oh right, this one doesn't count because it's inside. Okay, well, I think we're gonna do this one first. This is Dong Min himself against what is a uh, mostly militia type army. Nothing too special. What's Lu Bu's army actually? That's a lot of fucking militia shit as well, unless this is the... No, yeah, it's G-Militia. I need to figure out the difference exactly between the G-Militia and G-Infantry unit cards, because they're pretty similar, I think. Wait, there is a G-Infantry unit, right? Oh, I guess it would only be champions that can recruit them. Hold on. Give me a champion! Uh... Oh, there you go. So that's G-Infantry. Okay, they're both facing the same way, but this one's got a slightly bigger cap, I think. And then there's also heavy G-Infantry, which have a ton of armor, but are even slower, and they actually have mostly similar melee stats. Interesting. So many fucking units I haven't unlocked yet, <laughs> and I never will in this campaign. There are so many more campaigns to play, though! It's gonna be great! I've already started the Gongdu one, as I'm sure most of you have already seen. Um, and yeah, and there's gonna be one replacing this one too. Right, let's... F oh shit, he's in, he's in encampment stance, so I don't really want to fight him then. Hmm, not sure what to do about that. I could... 
I could make one of these a 1v1. And then make the other one here. Actually, no, can you even reach? Uh, barely. Even if I could, even if that wasn't range, which I don't think it is, he would probably run away and then he wouldn't, I wouldn't be in range anymore. So yeah, I think I might let him be, actually. I'll just wait for this army to show up. In fact, I know I can't reach with you, but... If I force march you, no, that's too risky. Let's just walk you normally. I'd still be able to get there next turn. Yeah, barely, but yeah, that's good enough. So if he wants to attack my army in the field, he's welcome to do so. Both these armies could do some better units as well, to be fair. But at least we have those two units, and that's pretty important. Alright, so the last thing we can do here is attack him. Oh, fuck, except... can I even? Okay, let's see what happens. When I attack him, he's gonna run away. The thing is, can I... is this river gonna stop me from moving across? Okay, I can... I can do it like that. Alright. Is this is the fight against Lubu gonna be an Arvazov? <laughs> yeah, night battle. <laughs> Take up my own army. <laughs> um, it's not. It's, I mean, I could Arvazov it, and it would be pretty fine. But um, because he would. Well, no, he's gonna die regardless if I win this one. All right. Lubu's still level 7. I'm pretty sure he starts off at level 7, which is kind of interesting. Um, pretty solid army. I actually fought against this almost ex this exact army, probably, in the Gongdu campaign in episode 2, which you probably will have seen by the time this goes out, at least. Um, but yeah, Lubu is a fucking killing machine. We all knew that already. It'd be nice if I could capture him after this battle. Fuck me. It'd be insane. Uh, anyway, we're going to leave it here. Next time we're going to do this battle, should be pretty straightforward. We got uh, some pretty interesting characters in here. We got Sun Jian and Sun Tse. Uh, and then of course our ex-wife and uh, Sub-Zero. And um, Tofu Man. So that's pretty good. And also this guy. Just random G-Meow. Meow. He's a cat. Alright, next time. Until then, have a good day and goodbye.